Time Machine. Do you want a silky smooth mustache too? Donut Ranger, your days of evil doing are about to end. Man, bread's all over the TV. The most popular barbershop huh? in all of Bakery Town, the Bread Barbershop. Mm. And the proprietor is here with us today. Uh, he's everywhere. This is crazy. Master Bread, is it true your childhood dream was to be a barber? Uh, oh, uh, yes, sure. <laughs> uh, my mother told me many times I was born with barber scissors in one hand and a comb held in the other. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget you were also born annoying. And that's not all. Huh? I began to style hair at the young age of three. At first, my parents did not support my dreams and threw away my scissors and comb. But when some magical butterflies returned them to me, they knew it was my destiny. My! Even the heavens supported you. Well, of course. <laughs> uh, I'd love to teach that moldy bread a lesson and put him at his place. Hey, that's an idea. I'll take a time machine back to his childhood, then crush his little barber fantasy. Because what's more fun than crushing a cherished childhood dream? <laughs> Phew, what a thing of beauty. My very own time machine. With this, I'll toast that bread for good. Coming, baby bread. <laughs> now, maybe 30 years will be good? <laughs> Am I there yet? Ugh. This is rancid. What's with all this trash everywhere? Ugh. Right, this place was a trash can back in the day. Which means I'm really back in the past. I'm a genius. <laughs> yeah. Time travel is no party. Huh? Stop in the name of love! <laughs> Those kids look very familiar to me. Hmm. There's that new roller skating rink. But tonight I'm going to the discotheque. Huh. Huh. Huh? Huh? Wow, they're showing the oldies today, I see. Uh. Huh? <gasps> Wait! That little kid looks just like bread! <sighs> Yo, kid, what's your name? Who? Me? The name's Bread. Bread Pitt. <gasps> I met him on my first day! This is easier than uh, I thought it would be. So, got a dream of being a barber, eh? Uh, uh, no. Oh? Why dream of being a barber? You don't make any money and it's boring. I want to be like Mr. Hamburger! Become a famous movie star, make a ton of dough, and earn the adulation of the world! Huh? I thought you were born with scissors in one hand and a comb in the huh? other. Are you crazy or something, dude? How could Bread be born holding scissors in a comb? Bread? Uh? The movie's starting any minute now. Who are you talking to? Dad, I... Hmm? Huh? Huh? Where is he? <laughs> Come on, son. Let's go inside. Huh? What's up with him anyway? I thought he said his dream was to be a barber. It's a filthy lie. Maybe I went back just a little too far. Let's go see Bread as a young man. Yeah. Yeah. Whew. Hope I got the zone right. Huh? Huh? That's the Sweet Bun Barber Shop. I guess he still hasn't inherited the shop yet. Uh, uh. What's with buying such rotten and damaged fruit, huh? They they were just cheaper, that's all. I told you only the best ingredients, didn't I? Uh, well, looks like the little fella wasn't exactly employee of the month. I'm about to have way too much fun. <laughs> huh? Huh? How may I help you? Hmm. Huh? Uh. Uh. You can start by bringing your customer a refreshing drink! Uh, Is this how you treat your clientele? Uh, sir, I'm very sorry. Move it, Brad. Uh, Get our customer some tea, will you? Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> sir, a nice cup of black... Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Ah, it's hot! You scalded me! Uh, oh, sir, I'm sorry, sir. Brad, uh, uh, are you crazy? 
Sir, I apologize. This one's a new hire. Ah, uh, this must be the worst barbershop ever! Red, one more mishap like this and you're fired! What seems to be the problem, huh? Baguette? Sir, young Bread here spilled tea on a customer. My head is roasting! I'll sue you all! Uh, 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 sir? Bread, why don't you go home for the day? Uh, but... Go home. Now. Uh, I'll go, sir. Mm. Huh? <laughs> mm. That kid's a real pain in the neck, I tell you. He does nothing right, sir. He just needs some time to adjust. Huh, well, looks like his career is off to a shaky start. And I'm the guy who's gonna make it a lot shakier, see? <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> <laughs> hey, check it out. There goes that dummy Red. Look at his dumb mug. He's in trouble again. How come every time we see that dummy, he's on the verge of crying? That dummy Bread, huh? Looks like he's got a reputation. Look, there's Bread the dummy. My mom tells me I should study that <laughs> so I don't end up a dummy like him. Bread the dummy. Bread the dummy. Huh. When is that kid finally gonna grow up? His parents must be terribly ashamed of that boy. Huh, wow, this is interesting. Freddy sure got a lot of ridicule. Maybe I'll follow him a little longer. <laughs> hmm. I'm home. <laughs> huh? What's this? You mean, little Bread lives here? Roach, huh? I'm home. Huh? Hey there, buddy. How was your day today? No way! That's a roach, ain't it? Mine? Well, I got in trouble at the barber shop again. Hmm. He's really talking to a cockroach. All that stress at work must be taking a toll. Every day I mess up and get ridiculed. Maybe I don't have any talent. Today I spilled hot tea on a customer's head. Mr. Baguette got really mad about it and chewed me out. And Red Bean Bread told me I should just leave. I just don't know, little dude. Maybe I should go back home. What? And give up being a barber? What did you do to my hair? This is the worst barber shop ever. Potato Chip, you're not a hairdresser, you're a clown. Well, pal, I think I'll go now. You take care. What oh, kind of God. nonsense is that? You're the guy. I spilled tea on. I mean, I knew you were a total loser, but this is crazy. Uh, you're a total klutz, you drive people nuts, you're a pathetic fool. I know it's true. That's why I'm going to go home. But you want to know the most pathetic part, kid? Uh, you're giving up way too easily. What? You can make as many mistakes as you want, but don't you give up, got it? One day you're gonna be the best barber! I'm gonna be the best barber? You'll have a really nasty temper, you won't be easy on the eyes, and you're gonna lose all your hair! I'm gonna go bald! But as a hairdresser, you'll be known the world over. I promise you this. You're gonna be the best barber the world's ever seen, and I'm gonna be your rival. I don't understand you. I'm gonna show you just how talented you are. Be at the shop at 1 p.m. sharp tomorrow. There, all done. <laughs> well, next customer. Oh, be <laughs> so, sir, how would you like your hair done? I don't want you to cut my hair. I want that little guy to do it. <gasps> Bread? Sir, he is rather new here and doesn't have much experience. Pipe down, you. Yo, Bread, grab the shears and get over here. Let's see what you can do. Huh? Okay. <sighs> Hmm. Well done, sir. It's, it's a miracle. How did you create such a great look so quickly? Hey, this is cool. Told you, didn't I? Whoa. Uh -huh. Wow. How'd you create such a styling hairdo? Uh -huh. Would you do my hair, too? <laughs> Wait your turn, will ya? I asked him before you! <laughs> my friend, thank you, I... Huh? Oh. Where'd he go? <laughs> I 
I feel sick. Time travels heck on the stomach. Why did I go all the way back in time just to help him out? <laughs> huh? Potato chip, who gave you that ridiculous hairstyle? Next time, just come to Bread Barbershop. Yours truly will give you the VIP treatment. Why, you, I'm all the ungrateful. You wouldn't be the genius barber you are without me. What do you mean? It was me who, uh, uh, forget it, forget it. Huh? That's weird. Hmm. Robot Wilk. Uh, I hope they have a little muffins room in there. Me too. Why does Brett have so many customers? He's nothing but a heel. Oh. Wilk! How many times do I have to tell you? You mixed up the chocolate and strawberry creams uh -huh. again! But they're both creams, so does it matter? Uh -huh. That Wilk sure is clueless. Ah, which gives me an idea. I'm a genius. <laughs> hey, uh, Wilk, could you spare a moment of your time? Hey, Mr. Potato Chip. I'm on my way to work. What's up? Well, I was spring cleaning and I found a stack of Donut Ranger videos. <gasps> you have Donut Ranger? Oh, yeah, with the director's commentary and everything. Director's commentary? Can I see them? <laughs> <sighs> he did the thing. Wow. I didn't know you had a basement lab. I feel like I'm in a movie about a genius. <laughs> That's because I am a genius. I graduated magna cum laude from Tater State, you know. Oh, there you are. The videos are over there, so enjoy. Thank you so much. <laughs> Donut Ranger, here I come. Huh? Ha! What's going on? <laughs> you actually fell for it. Talk about thick milk. Oh, Mr. Potato Chip, please let me out. I'm going to be late for work. Work? Don't you worry about work. I've arranged for someone to take your place. Behold! Robot Wilk! Uh, 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 you mean the robot will go to work instead of me? Yes! That way you can watch Donut Ranger all day! But they're expecting me at work! I bet there isn't any director's commentary. Uh, I'm gonna give Will two more seconds, huh? I have arrived, Master Bread. Wilk, why are you so late? You won't have time to clean! Tidy, tidy. Tidy, tidy. Tidy, tidy. Tidy, tidy. Hello, sir. I will get you your black tea now. Uh, okay. Black tea, black tea, black tea, black tea. <sighs> Oh. Is it just me, or does Wilk seem a little off today? Yeah, he's doing things right. Master Bread, here is your black tea. Oh, thank you. Oh, this flavor! I am the keeper of the secret key! You really have stepped up your game, Wilk. Keep up the good work. You are too nice. <laughs> <laughs> Robot Wilk is working out just as I planned. And now it's time to turn bread into crows. Mr. Potato <laughs> Chip? <laughs> you scared the chip out of me. What do you want? Could I have something to drink? <laughs> Here, here's water. Uh, uh, do you think you could get me a soda <laughs> instead? <laughs> <laughs> soda! <laughs> now that I've had soda, I want to eat pizza. Do you think you could order me a pizza? Ah, uh, uh, yes, hello, I'd like a pizza delivery. Make sure there's extra cheese. Uh, <laughs> make it with extra cheese, please. And can they do the surf and turf topping? Ah! <laughs> oh, Wilk, your technique has vastly oh. improved. I learned it from watching you, Master Bread. <laughs> All my efforts have finally paid off. Ha, 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 <laughs> Something's not right. Mr. Potato Chip? What? What is it now? Uh, uh, 
Uh, I think I ate too much. Do you think you could get me some lactate? Ah, I can't take it anymore! Once the robot takes out bread, you'll be expired now! What? You're going to take out Mr. Bread? That's right! Bread is gonna be toast! And all I have to do is press the button! <laughs> oh, no! And with the bread gone, the chip will be the star of the oh. party! <laughs> What can I do for you? Master Bread, I will give you a head massage now. Oh, a massage would be splendid. I have to do something fast. Uh, huh. Uh -huh. This must be the remote that controls the robot. I have to use this to stop it. <laughs> Master Bread, mm. do you like your massage? Yes, massage is the one thing you've always been good at. Do you want me to apply more pressure? Stop! <laughs> Wait, uh, since what are there two uh, Wilkes? Master Bread, watch out! That Wilkes a fake! He's a robot version of me that Mr. Potato Chip sent to take you out! Take me out? Oh no, huh? do not listen to him. I am the real Wilk. Uh, how can I tell which one of you is real? Aha! When did I see episode 27 of Donut Ranger? I am going to search for it. There is no 27. Uh, Donut Ranger ends with episode 26. That means that the <gasps> fake Wilk is you. Oh, no, but he made me do it. Now, I will cut off your crust, and then I will burn your toast. Uh, oh, please, don't hurt us. Uh, uh, Mr. Bread, uh, uh, don't worry. I can stop the robot with this remote control. So long, imposter. Oh, no. Huh? Uh. Wilk, why did you turn on the AC? Wait a minute, why is uh. it working? <laughs> huh? You cardinal uh. curd, that's the AC remote. <laughs> what? You're trying to save the day with the AC remote? Uh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Robot Wilk, it's time to slice the bread. Oh, no, you don't. Uh. I won't let you hurt Master uh. Bread. Now, give me that remote. Get off me! I'll take you out first! <laughs> I will obey. <laughs> Shall I whip you into a milkshake or freeze you into ice cream? <laughs> Wilk, you're destroying my golden trophy! I'm sorry, Master Bread! <laughs> Hasta la vista, Wilk. <laughs> Wilk, Wilk. Oh, my aching back. Are you okay, Master Bread? Uh, uh, yeah, are you okay, Wilk? I'm just fine, Master Bread. Huh? Uh, uh, huh? No! How dare you! Do you know how hard I slaved over that robot? Ah! Potato chip, huh? you're under arrest! Ah! Let me go, I'm innocent! Are you guys okay? Well, I felt better. Chuckle, it's so good to see you! Something was weird, so I called the police. But it looks like you two took care of it. Let me go! It wasn't me, I tell you! It was the robot! Let's go. That tuber trash thought he could send a robot to take me out? It was all my fault, oh. Master Bread. If only I hadn't gone to uh. watch Donut Ranger. What? <gasps> you were watching Donut Ranger instead of coming to work? Uh. Robot Wilk was so good on the job. Oh. Huh? That's not very nice, Master Bread. Uh, How could I, I was only kidding. Chip's chip. Chip. Uh, just another day without a customer. Excuse me, is huh? this a salon? Huh? <laughs> sure is, oh. sir. This is the best barbershop in town, run by the one and only Potato Chip. <gasps> Look, uh, 
Over there! Red Barbershop! Hey, I've heard that Master Bread, who works there, is supposed to be the best! He is! There's no greater barber in the whole world! I heard that if you don't reserve an appointment two months in advance, you can't get in! I want him to do my hair! Hurry, let's go stand in line! I can't believe we almost went to this place! <laughs> <laughs> Brad! That guy's ruining my life! If only I could control that stupid stale slice up! Huh? Hang on! Yeah! I've got it! You're done for, Brad! <laughs> It's finally done! This computer chip will allow me to control bread wherever he goes. The control chip goes on me right here. And I just need some way to stick this on bread's forehead. Then he'll do whatever I tell him to. Time to practice my master plan. Yeah! Ooh, awesome! Excellent! <laughs> Now go and plant yourself on that crusty old wheat. Well, Bread, your business is about to expire. Welcome to Bread Barbershop. Uh, disgusting. Who let a fly in here? Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, huh? Ah, it worked! It really worked! <laughs> Think of all the fun I'll have now! Watch out, Fred! First things first, let's ruin that face. Uh, 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 what the? Hey, uh, be you good? Mr. Bread, uh, what are you doing, sir? Do what? you like to dance? Because here's a boogie! Uh. Now they've both lost their marbles. Huh. There's more where that came from. <laughs> is that how he normally is? I think he's finally lost it from working too hard. The pain is worth it to sabotage bread. Uh, uh, I need a quick break. Sabotage requires hydration. Uh, uh, wait, don't make him drink water. <laughs> Only the hot sauce for bread. Oh, Mr. Bread, don't do this to yourself. <laughs> How do you like that? You'll be suffering in no time. But there's even more options. <laughs> Wasabi down the hat. <laughs> Well, surely everyone thinks you're off your rocker by now. But even that is not enough. I want to make sure I ruin his entire business. Aha! So what if he raises the employee's salaries? Surely he'll lose tons of money fast if he does that. All right. Your employees are going to make ten times more. Mr. Brad, what's wrong with you? Please say something, sir. Uh, Master... A new contract. Sign it now. New? Uh, uh, Employee pay. Uh, All wages increase tenfold starting today. Uh, he's lost uh, it. Every time he has to pay us, he cries all the way home. Plus, everyone uh, can only work four uh, hours a day. Sometimes weeks without seeing the inside of my house. There's more. No way. Once a month, employees will receive bonuses and vacation time. Uh, bless your friend. <laughs> Just tell Come on, just sign it already. <gasps> <laughs> just perfect. Your business will crumble when you waste all your money on your staff. Huh? Why are there so many customers? For tonight's top story, a shop where employees work harder than their boss. So inspiring. What motivates your staff in your work? Brett has shown us that he's a boss who cares about us, and so we should work harder. Huh? Be right there. Yeah! Huh? <sighs> 
Welcome to Bread Barbershop. Thank you for coming today. You can choose any hairstyle you like and we'll be with you shortly. Thanks. <laughs> Their service is over the top. What a lovely place to work. Mix, mix, mix. Mix, 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 mix. Are there any complaints about working at the Bread Barbershop? I can't talk right now. I have to work. Ugh. I'll make a thousand cans of cream by the time the day is done. Welcome to Bread Barbershop, please. Oh, I've never seen such hard work in my whole life! Uh, no way! Yeah, I tried to make bread go broke, but I ended up making everyone happier! No time for this! Bread, cut all your prices by 50%! Oh, haircuts are now 50% off! <laughs> yep, our boss has gone cuckoo! <laughs> I've always wanted to come here, but was never able to afford it before today. You've made an old woman's dreams come true. <laughs> I used to tell my kids to cut their own hair to save on costs, but now I can have theirs done by a professional. Wait, it's so cool. Super cool. Well, seems Fred Barbershop's never been more popular. His generosity is becoming famous throughout town. Uh, he's supposed to be broke, but nothing is going my way. Stupid popular love of bread. Uh, Here's what I'll do. Make him throw away everything he loves. Bread, take your car keys and throw them away. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thanks to your generous donation, we'll be able to take the orphans to picnics and school outings. Thank, thank you, you for, for the cars. <laughs> I can take more away from your life. Bread, you're going to give away the deed to your very house. As mayor of Bakery Town, I give you my thanks. Your house will make a wonderful new nursing home. Thank you, Bread. Such a kind man. It just warms my old heart. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah! Yeah! Ah! Why can I never win? He's doing better than ever. This isn't fair! It's time to take things to the extreme. Throw every last penny you make away! Bakery Town's very own hero, Bread. Your selflessness is an inspiration to us all. I hereby make you a knight. I heard that only one bread every 100 years gets knighted. Well, there's no one who deserves it more. <laughs> now, our hero statue will be revealed. All his wealth was donated. The most selfless bread in the whole world. His name will be in the history books for all time. They, they made a statue of him out of gold? Long live bread! Long live bread! Long live bread! Long live bread! Okay, bread. Guess I'll have to use my last resort. Bread, you're gonna go get the deed to your business and come outside and give it to me! Yes! The Bread Barber Shop will soon be by! <laughs> bread Barber Shop now, now belongs, belongs to, to Chip! <laughs> 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 My head. What's going on? Master uh, Red! Master Red! Uh, uh, Red! What's gotten Master into you? Hey! Uh, uh, put me down! Red! This hurts Master my back! Uh, 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 hey! Uh, uh, I'll sue every last one of you! Stop this merriment right now! Uh, one year later. Mom? What's that big statue of? Why, that's the hero of Bakery Town. His name is Bread. Maybe you'll grow up to be a hero and a generous man <laughs> just like him. Huh? <laughs> Everybody loves Bread. Potato Chip loves him so much he's polishing the statue for free. Wow, what an awesome guy! I want to be just like Bread when I grow up. Can I, Mom? Of course, sweetie. <laughs> Terminator Bread. I love 
There's nothing going on tonight. Yeah. Hey, check out the love muffins. How about we do a little target practice, huh? Ooh, that sounds sweet. Hey, what's up, you doughhead? <laughs> Darling, you okay? Hey! <laughs> Bullseye! Perfect shot. They look kind of mean. Come on, honey, let's go home. <laughs> yeah, someone needs to teach them a lesson. <laughs> what say we find our next victim, huh? <laughs> What's going on? Uh, over there! Look at that lightning! What uh, the bread is that? A monster? <laughs> <laughs> Check out the tiny. <laughs> Guess baby's not potty trained yet, huh? <laughs> oh. He's sitting this way. Oh, yeah? You want a bite of me? Huh? Uh. 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 Think you're so tough? Uh. Uh. Please don't hurt me anymore. Just ask. I'll give you anything you want. All right. I want your clothes. My clothes? Sure, why not? Did you want the pants as well? <laughs> Thanks. Nice to meet you. Hello, <sighs> Ice <sighs> Wonderful. A refreshing way to start the morning. <gasps> hey, what's the big idea? Huh? <gasps> what is this? Who, who are you? I am the Bredonator. <laughs> Bredonator? That's hilarious. <laughs> I'm sorry I laughed at you. It's not funny at all. Disposable cops should be terminated. Switch to reusable. Oh, but reusable is such a hassle. Hey, you! He's pressing my hand! Help Let's me! go see. Looks like in a movie. Hey, they could be twins, couldn't they? Which one is Master Bread? Uh, 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 leave me! Oh, good, he's not following me! Uh, he's so fast! Taxi! Quick! Red Barbershop! Step on it! Yeah. Uh, uh, the love of yeast! Why aren't we moving? It looks like we're stuck. Huh? What is that? Taxi's up bad. You just pour it, will you? Get me out of here! <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? Why are you taking a taxi when your shop is only a three-minute walk? You're destroying the environment. Well, see, sometimes I'm running a little behind. And Emissions from cars can be very harmful. They pollute the air and create excess smog. So take it from me, if you can walk. <laughs> I've been renovated! <laughs> I hope he didn't follow me here. Mr. Bread, uh, what is it? Did something happen? Uh, yeah, this crazy bread was following me, and I tried to run it. Ah! How the bread did you get here before me? Well, Taco, there he is, right there. So is he like uh, your brother? Yeah, you're pretty, I think. Uh, are you crazy? This guy's an alien robot monster. We have to run. Ah! Uh, what is it you want from me anyway? I want nothing from you. I came to teach you about the environment. The environment? But why? Perhaps you have not been listening to me. Uh, <laughs> let's take it easy, you two. I'll turn on the air conditioner and we can... Conditioned air is completely unnecessary. If you turn on your air conditioner, carbon dioxide levels will rise, and that will make the Earth warmer. If the Earth warms by two degrees, sea levels will rise, and the cities will be flooded. Millions of baked goods may one day be lost. Electric fans are a safer choice. Well, I guess you're right. <gasps> All right. Huh? Uh. Choco, what are you yelling about? Did something exciting happen? Mm-hmm. The dress I ordered is coming today. I can't wait to wear it. <gasps> What's wrong with you? Choco, do you know how much water is used to make the clothing we wear? 2,000 liters are used to make a single T-shirt. 10,000 liters are used to make a pair of jeans. Can that be true? Dyeing fabrics for clothes causes a great amount of water pollution. From now on, buy only what you need. I didn't know. I'll do better. Bread, Will, <gasps> Choco, you don't understand that pollution is very serious. So I am here to teach you all how you can make a difference. <laughs> uh, looks empty. 
Oh, Wilk, <coughs> bring me a new one. Huh? Huh? Um, why'd you do that? Looks to me like there's still a lot left. We just have to give it a good huh? shake. <laughs> Hi, Wilk here. Oh, hey, Cheese. Huh? Wasting water is very dangerous. Baked goods can get burned due to water scarcity. Use water more efficiently, Wilk. Okay. I'd like to place an order. The sushi special with the side salad. Mm. <laughs> what are you doing? 8.5 million pieces of trash are from food deliveries. Homemade meals are more responsible. Uh, uh, that Rednator guy's a total pain in the crust! Who does that loaf think he is? Hey, you! Uh, you didn't separate uh, your recyclables. What are you doing? Tissues aren't recyclable. Spray cans are plastic. The newspaper should be separated. So get separating. Why are you making life harder for me? Mr. Bread, what's wrong? What did the Breadinator do to you now? The Breadinator decided to empty my trash on the street. What? <laughs> on the street? That is so rude. Well, he did not separate his recyclables. This is imperative so that paper and plastic can be reused in the future. Mixing paper and plastic is in the end of the world! Ah, ah. Big red towns collapsing due to that selfish, godless thinking! Uh, uh. Hang on! You're from the future, aren't you? That's right. The town's courting disaster. I know because I've seen the consequences. Uh, oh, wait, what? Look, it's a hologram! Due to pollution, water is undrinkable. The air has become so poisoned that every citizen wears a gas mask. Is that really uh, our future? Master Brett, I'm scared! And while the people of Bakery Town are suffering from pollution, one man decides to make a robot in his own image. And that man is none other than Master Brett. What? Hey, that's me! Oh, Master Bread, you're crying! In the future, Rilk is suffering the effects of polluted water. Choco has become moldy due to poison there. Oh, no way! Uh, I've got mold all over me. Bread, when you saw your friend suffering from so much pollution, you created me. You sent me to the past to save Bakery Town from a dreadful fate. So, I'm your father? It's not too late, Bread. You can save your friends and change the future, but you must protect the environment. I had no idea. I didn't realize pollution could be so serious, but now I know. I'll definitely be more careful now. Now that you understand, go forth and change the future. Will do. Yeah. Stop! Ah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you know, I have to admit, I like being responsible. I agree. Even the air smells a lot cleaner, too. Bakery Town's future's <laughs> looking a whole lot brighter. <gasps> Excuse me, that isn't where your trash should go. Trash should go in a trash receptacle. Don't forget, cans are recyclable. Uh, my bad. We'll clean up the town one day at a time. Isn't it great, sir? Hmm. You are all working hard. And it's all thanks to you, Bredinator. We're really <laughs> grateful. That's good, because I am afraid my time is up. Huh? Uh, what time? You mean you're going? I was only built to last <gasps> one week. But that can't be! Thankfully, I was able to spread the message to you all about the dangers of pollution. Since you now possess that information, my mission is done, and I must go. No, wait. You can't go away now. We need your help. We have so much more to do. Soon, my body will no longer work. Go and spread my message to all the other big goods you know. No, my robot son! <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back. Please stay! <laughs> 30 years later. <sighs> Wilk, Choco, hang in there. Predator said it wouldn't end this way. Huh? Oh. 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 <laughs> wow! Look at the sky! The dust isn't there anymore! The air 
is so fresh and clean. Mama, can I have a drink now? The water is much cleaner. Uh, let me try. <laughs> oh, lovely. Oh, it's so good. <sighs> I can breathe freely. We'll never have to wear those masks again. Retinator uh, really uh, saved us all. Master <laughs> Red. Huh? Wilk, Choco, you look so much better. <laughs> but how did it happen, sir? I'm completely mold free. Hmm? Wait! <sighs> <sighs> Retinator, you saved the day. How can we thank you? Because of you, Bakery Town is more beautiful than ever. Queen of Calculation. This is outrageous! How can my bill be $50? What seems to be the problem, madam? I would like to know why I have been overcharged on my bill. Chocolate, $10. Whipped cream, $20. Cherry on top, $10. That's $40. So why does my bill say $50? I, I'm sorry. Oh, dear. Uh, there does seem to be a discrepancy. Hm. I'm so gold, I simply won't pay anything. Perhaps you should hire a cashier who knows how to do math. Uh, please, wait! I... No! Choco! How can you be a cashier and still not know simple math? If you make one more mistake, I'll... <laughs> well, if it ain't moldy bread in his shabby little shop. Listen, Chip, leave your nasty insults outside, please. Who hires a dumb cashier these days? What's that? I got me a brand new invention. Meet CashierBot! Beep, beep. CashierBot is not only quick, but 1,000% accurate. It's cashierific. How can this robot be better than Choco? Ha! I'll prove it to you. What's 2,243 times 24 minus 425 plus 56? Mm. Well, let me see. 53,463. Ding, ding, ding! Ha, ha, ha. Not exactly a math genius, are you? <gasps> so, Brad, how much do you pay uh, Choco anyway? Seven fifty a week. Seven fifty? You pay a cashier seven fifty a week? Cashier Bob would only cost you a mere thirty bucks a month. You don't say. That's right. Care to take it for a test run? Huh? Oh. Master uh, Red, you're not really considering this, are you? Well, maybe. Ah! Then I uh, resign. Uh, uh, you mean you quit? You need to have time to write this. <laughs> I've worked at that barbershop every day for five years. How could he do this? 53,463. Oh. Oh, if only I were good at math. Isn't this that famous math school uh, I've heard about? Huh? My daughter got straight A's after they tutored her. <gasps> Mr. Non really is a brilliant <laughs> math teacher. Maybe he can help my little one with her multiplication tables. I'm sure he can. <gasps> Mr. Non's Math Academy. Mr. Non. Goodbye, sir. <laughs> hmm? ah. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> uh... Uh, is this the math school? Maybe I made a mistake. Greetings. Uh? Are you here to learn arithmetic? Uh, yeah. How old are you, my dear? I'm 25 years old. In other words, you're 788,400,000 seconds old. Lost what? five seconds since I finished that last sentence. Uh, how can you calculate something like that so quickly? Allow me to introduce myself. I am not the traditional Indian bread. The non of India were there at the beginnings of mathematics. We created the duo decimal system. Duo what now? Most bread use decimal digits to count, but the duo decimal system has 12 digits. That means we can calculate faster than other bread. Even a brainless bread can become a mathematical genius after learning our system. Would you like to enroll in the class, my dear? Okay. <laughs> How come there's a grown-up in class? Oh, no. Maybe she's bad at math. Settle down, please. Mm -hmm. Have you all completed your door decimal homework assignment? Yes! Let's recite now. 12 times 11, 132. 12 times 12, 144. No way. These are harder than times tables. Choco, what is 3 times 4? It's, uh... The answer is 12. She doesn't know. I see that we have much work to do. 20,697... Huh? Yep. Yeah. Uh, who threw that? Uh. <laughs> Red roll, 90. Your score has gone down, I'm afraid. Strawberry Choco, 98. Excellent. And Choco, 12. 
The lowest grade in the class. The, the lowest? <laughs> she got a 12! <laughs> <sighs> oh, I'm just no good at arithmetic. That old lady <gasps> She must be senile. That's what happens when you get old. Did you see when Mr. Nod threw the chalk at her? Mm. Oh, you little... Ashamed? Huh? Well... A bad grade is nothing uh... to be ashamed about, Choco. What? The only thing that is truly shameful is giving up even before you begin. No one is good from the start. What matters is that you keep going. That's how you get good. Make the choice. Will you give up on yourself, or will you be a champion? I choose champion. Six times four, 24. Six times five, 30. <laughs> Don't get sleepy. Six times six equals 36. <gasps> no sleep. 3.70 at 375. Hmm. Very good. Today's top test score goes to Choco. Impressive. You're my first student ever to get a perfect score. Thanks, Mr. Nan. <laughs> what is it, sir? Please have a seat. Choco, you have become the best student in the history of the academy. The time has come. I shall now teach you the final secret of the duodecimal system. Huh? The final secret? Correct. I call it the non -na non dance non -na non dance In order to truly master the duodecimal system, you must mm -hmm. perform the mystical non -na non dance M Maybe I'm not ready for this, sir. Mm. non 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 Yeah. Uh, Mr. Non. non 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 Yeah. Oh. The non 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 dance is the only way to become a true master. But I can't do it. I just can't. Ah! Choco, the non 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 dance is mandatory. I'd like to pay my bill. My eyesight isn't good. Are you a new automated thingy? Uh, Ma'am, may I help you with something? I don't like machinery. Oh. Here, where's the cashier? <laughs> oh. This is her cashier. But where's that nice young uh -huh. lady? Folks like me don't like these newfangled things. Uh, Yo, Brad. Yes, Chip, what can I do for you? I stopped by today to give you an update. The price for the cashier bot rental is now $5,000 a month. What? I thought you said 30. Inflation, buddy. Uh, Everything's more expensive these days. Uh, you rotten. <laughs> Since you fired that cashier, you're gonna have to pay up, my friend. <laughs> Potato uh. chip. Choco! Well, lucky who came back. The mathematical genius cashier who can't even add two plus one. Oh, yeah? I'm here to challenge your fancy robot. Choco, you can't possibly beat a robot. He's right. Uh. Don't even try. <laughs> you want a contest, huh? We accept your challenge. <laughs> the first problem is this. 129 plus 97 times 62 minus 84. 139928. 146 times 78 plus 31 minus 6. 11693. Amazing! She knows every answer! I see. How could you fire this intelligent young lady? <laughs> well, well, this dum dum's really good. I have no choice. Time for my secret weapon. Chip face, don't you dare try anything funny. Huh? <clears throat> now, where was I? What's 453 times 159 minus 67 plus 246? Plus 789 minus 312 divided by 2. Minus 456 times 24 divided by 4. Minus 87,462 plus 24. Malfunction, malfunction. How can anyone solve a math problem that long? I honestly feel like my head is curdling. <sighs> Choco, the non 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 dance is mandatory! It looks like I have no choice. Choco, what are you doing? Ah, get off of there, will ya? Nan, 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 yeah! Nan, 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 yeah! Ah, what is this? It is the gate to the dual decimal system. Who are you? Open the gate, child. 
and all the secrets of math will be revealed to you. Uh, I can't. One, two, seven, eight, seven, five. Ah! How could she? Jocko's uh, ah! right! Cannot help you do much math! Oh! Uh, uh, my gosh, your butt exploded! Jocko, how did you get so good at math? You were great! How can you think so quickly? It's a long story. Now that cashier bot is gone, who would you consider coming back as our cashier? Well, oh. what's it pay? Oh. How's a thousand a week sound? No. Oh, Two thousand? Mm, I'll accept your uh. offer. Oh, Choco, I'm so glad you're back. 